Wealth can also be that attitude of gratitude with which we remind ourselves every day to count our blessings. Sometimes the only way we can discover our true power is by living through the crisis we feared. It's okay to fail, it's not okay to quit. You won't find magic potions here. No matter how enticing they may seem, promises of quick fixes mostly set us up for failure and do more to deter us than empower us. Now I know a lot of us would rather skip over whatever happened back in the day, because it's painful or obsolete, as some would say, because there's nothing to do to change it, other than to let it go or get over it. But if we do that, we risk losing our knowledge of what really makes us happy, the pure essence of joy that we knew as children. And if we don't take the time to reclaim the dreams that we may have left back there in the thorny and golden past, we will be poorer for it. Until you are at home in yourself, familiar with the knowledge of the gold of who you are, where you come from, where you've been, and who you were meant to be, you'll be basically homeless. In other words, until you can come to value all experience, and find some happiness in everything you've lived and will live, you will be without your ultimate riches. This is your worth, who you really are, your degree that can go with you wherever you go, that you bring with you the moment you come into a room, that can't be manipulated or shaken. Without that sense of self, no amount of paper, no pedigree, and no credentials can make you legit. No matter what, you have to feel legit inside first. The future was uncertain, absolutely, and there were many hurdles, twists, and turns to come, but as long as I kept moving forward, one foot in front of the other, the voices of fear and shame, the messages from those who wanted me to believe that I wasn't good enough, would be stilled. Others may question your credentials, your papers, your degrees. Others may look for all kinds of ways to diminish your worth. But what is inside you no one can take from you or tarnish. This is your worth, who you really are, your degree that can go with you wherever you go, that you bring with you the moment you come into a room, that can't be manipulated or shaken. Walk that walk and go forward all the time. Don't just talk that talk, walk it and go forward. Also, the walk didn't have to be long strides, baby steps counted too. Go forward. Still a dreamer, yet more of a realist than ever before, I knew this was my time to sail. On the horizon I saw the shining future, as before. The difference now was that I felt the wind at my back. I was ready. But if you don't take the necessary steps to make them happen, dreams are just mirages that mess with your head. There was a language specific to all things. The ability to learn another language in one arena, whether it was music, medicine, or finance, could be used to accelerate learning in other arenas, too. No one ever laid out the sequence of events that led to my mother being prosecuted and imprisoned for alleged welfare fraud. Then again, what seems like nothing in the eyes of the world, when properly valued and put to use, can be among the greatest riches.